Good evening. My name is Tim, and I am a college math and college algebra tutor, and I'll be showing you how to solve rational equations. Here we have two of them to be solved. Our first step, beginning with this one to solve, is to eliminate the fractions. We're going to multiply this equation by the common denominator, in this case, is x squared minus 1 because the product of x minus 1 and x plus 1 is x squared minus 1. Now we're going to multiply x over x minus 1 times x squared minus 1 cancels out the x minus 1 and leaves us with x times x plus 1. minus 1 over x plus 1 times x squared minus 1. The x plus 1 cancels <clears throat> and leaves you with 1 times x minus 1 equals and then 2 over x squared minus 1 times x squared minus 1. The x squared minus 1 is cancel. Let me go with just 2. Next step, we distribute in both terms, giving us x squared plus x minus x plus 1. Because when we distribute the 1, we're distributing negative 1 in reality. Equals 2. Add like terms. x squared, x minus x is 0. Plus 1 equals 2. Then we subtract 1 to get x squared equals 1. We square with both sides to get x equals plus and minus 1. Now here's the deal. If we plug in positive 1, we're going to get a do not exist situation, 1 over 0. If we plug in negative 1, we're going to have another 1 over 0 situation. And if we plug in either negative 1 or positive 1 into 2 over x squared minus 1, it's going to be 2 over 0. That means the solution is all real x values except 1 and negative 1. Okay, now this one, multiplying by the common denominator again, in this case the common denominator is 4x. 1 over 4x times 4x is 1, minus 2 over x times 4x, the x is canceled, 2 times 4 is what, 8, equals 3 times 4x, 12x. See that? So now we have 1 minus 8, negative 7, equals 12x. Now we have to solve for x. Divide 12. So x equals negative 7 over 12. I hope this helped. My name is Tim. Let me know if you have any questions. Thank you.